Edgy Labs, my name is Ben. Good morning, hello, and welcome to the Micro Soaring Show. And today in the morning, I just want to introduce you a complete new tool on the market. I want to introduce you the iBox Mini. It's similar to the iRepairBox P10. And um, what this little box can do is just by using only a Windows PC um, and the software to get the phone into the purple mode, your iPhone into the purple mode, all devices which um, which uh, can do the, uh, which support the checkmate exploit. Um, with all these devices you can do that and you can modify NAND data, you can unbind Wi-Fi, so you can do a Wi-Fi repair on an iPhone 8 for example without taking out the NAND or you can do um, a NAND repair if the NAND is not physically damaged and you can read and write the NAND, you can um, you can do error 9 repair okay so that is what the iBox mini can do and I want to show you that beautiful tiny little thing here so we go straight to the on hands camera and that's the iBox mini the iBox mini comes with a uh, lightning cable and with a cable which you can connect from the iBox to your phone this is all what you need and um, if you have these tools and you have the software which you can download. I will uh, uh, paste the link uh, under that video, um, and then you can just um, just have a look, download, um, get the iRepair P10 or the iBox Mini, and you can modify NAND data, unbind Wi-Fi, and things like that. I want to show show to you how easy this works. Okay, so what we need to do at first is just to get the phone into the DFU mode. After that, I start the software, and um, then we can just check what about um, you. Yeah, what about um, modifying NAND data? So I connect the phone to the PC by just using the normal cable. I press volume up, volume down. I press the side button as long as the screen is getting dark, black. Then I press volume down, two, three, four, five, five seconds. Then I release the side button and just press the volume down button. As long as the phone is recognized at DFU mode. So, and if we are at DFU mode, we just start the iRepair P10 software. I want to show the software to you here. Yeah, here we are. So now we just connect the DFU box or the iBox Mini, sorry, the iBox Mini, and we connect the cable here and we connect the cable to the iPhone. And now the software says, okay, we have a DFU model here. And now I click on that. And you see the initialization process, okay? And then you see some numbers coming up through the software. And we see the phone is getting into the purple mode. And that's really great. That's really a great thing. So I have need to take a look if you see all. Yeah, you should see all, okay, like that. And now um, we can one time say, okay, I first want to back up um, the sysconfig. So the whole, um, the whole uh, NAND data. So, okay, I save them, not a problem. And here we can see now all the data on the right side we can now click on unlock Wi-Fi if we do this click and after that um, we just uh, reboot the device Wi-Fi is unlocked and if Wi-Fi is unlocked um, so you have to solder down before a new Wi-Fi I see after that you go into the purple mode and you unlock Wi-Fi yeah and then you just reboot the device and the device will work with a new Wi-Fi chip and you can activate and no problem. Now I just want to take a look if this 
really if, if the box really works so if I change now one number of the serial the phone should say I can't activate anymore okay so we just take the 9 at the end and replace it with an 8 okay then we say write okay write serial yeah now we query the info again and okay we have another serial now so let's check I just close the software now and uh, disconnect the cable and now volume up volume down and side button as long as the apple comes and the device boots again okay the device boots again normally now the device should say hey I can't activate because my my serial number changed and if we replace that with a 9 at the end the phone should work again so let's see if we can get that is it really as easy as this to just modify NAND data at a device like the iPhone 8 so no more solder work I don't have to take out the NAND for modifying NAND data is this really the case here let's see if the iBox Mini can do that. Let's wait for a boot. Oh, and now the phone, you saw it before, it was activated. So now we have a serial ending with the 8. And now, just waiting for the activation. And it says no more activation possible. Okay, so let's get it back to the DView mode. Volume up, volume down, side button. Until the screen is getting black. One, two, three, four, five. Release the side button. Wait until the phone is detected in DView mode. Okay, here we are. Now we connect the iBox. Now we open the software. Agree. Yeah, you should see that here. That's great. And now we just connect the iBox Mini. We click on that here. We wait, connecting. And we wait for the initialization process and you see it's really easy about eight minutes and you know all the functions of this iBox here okay now we should go to the purple mode yeah boom yeah here we are purple mode and now we just query the info and we say hey here we want to have a 9 because that's the right serial we write that right okay now we can query the info again we see okay it's the 9 we close the software we disconnect the phone and we just press up down side button and wait until the apple flashes okay here we are and let's wait for a boot now the phone should work again normally with the right serial the 9 at the end and it should work it's really easy because you don't have to use okay 
that's just normal because we changed the serial before now we have a look we can activate the phone okay let's see if the serial is right again yeah we have the 9 at the end so that's just normal okay we take the right but it's possible that we need to do an update on iTunes because the phone was locked now one time so let's see sometimes we need to do oh here we are again okay just needed some time and you see the phone is working fine again with all the data on it yeah so we just changed one part of the serial so you see i can modify NAND data without even taking out the NAND and that's just a real crazy thing and it's so easy and in the video before where i uh, where to show you how it works with the use of this DFU box C2 I said okay why buying such an expensive box if you can do it in that way so there are two ways yeah if you need if you want to use the CFU box C2 or a serial cable like that you just need a normal lightning cable a Mac with the purple software then you can get the phone into the purple mode and after that you can modify the NAND data by using the Fubox C2 or a serial cable uh, with the JC repair suit okay but the other way is just to use one PC one Windows PC with one software the P10 software or, or the the iBox software I can give you both links underneath uh, under this video it's not a problem and then you can use the iBox Mini or the iRepairBox P10 um, for modify NAND data. In my opinion, really a great thing, um, which uh, which um, saves a lot of time. So as I heard for first of these boxes, yeah, uh, I want to be uh, honest to you. I said, oh no, it, it it won't work, and it's based on a jailbreak. It's based on an exploit on the Checkmate exploit, and I can take the NAND out in about two or three minutes not a problem at all but now after using the, this box and I saw that it really works great fast and easy it just saves a lot of time okay it, it really saves a lot of time because I can just swap the, the Wi-Fi module and after that using um, the box or um, if I have a, a corrupted NAND I can just rewrite the data without even opening the phone and that's a real big advantage and if you use a box like this, you have one software, you have one PC, you have just a cable to plug in and it works. So I can recommend this, uh, this tool 100%. You can get it um, at uh, unionrepair.com if you want uh, to order. Um, there you can get the P10. This year I ordered from, uh, or, uh, was sent to me from, from uh, another friend of China. But I don't know if they have a website or things like that just mailed it so thanks to Lena at this point and um, yeah I think great tool you should get it um, go to unionrepair.com and order the uh, iBox or the uh, P10 box great thing okay I'm out and um, we see us later with a repair video this was just a, a small video for the iBox mini okay so check it out boom back to life again yes Ben